Okay, now that we have PFSense installed, now it's time to set up the network interface cards, aka NICs. Okay, PFSense is starting up. You can press F1 or just wait. We'll wait. It'll automatically select number one. Okay. Have some important information here. So we have two network cards. One is an Intel, one is an AMD. The Intel is EM0, the AMD is PCN0. These are abbreviated names for the network card driver. So if you have two different cards, you'll see two different type of two different driver names. If you have both of the you have both NICs of the same brand, these will both be the same. But they will have different uh, MAC addresses. And I'll add what a MAC address is in the resources. Now, as I mentioned earlier, let's say for instance, these were both the same. How do you tell which is WAN and which is LAN? One trick is to unplug one of the cables from the switch. So I'm going to simulate that with my virtual machine. I'll unplug one. Okay, here we go. EM0 link state change to down. So we know the one you unplug is EM0. So I'm going to plug it back in virtually. And it should say up in a second. All right, link state change to up. All right, now the thing is, it's going to pick up from the last question. So right here, do you want to set up VLANs? VLANs is uh, short for virtual LANs, and that's an advanced topic we'll discuss in a later lecture or maybe a later course. So we're going to press in for no. All right, now it's asking which NIC is going to be the WAN. So since you unplugged the cable, you know which is which now. So I'm going to make EM0 my WAN. So I'll type EM0, enter. And I'll have one network card left, so we'll type in PCN0. Oh, that was a nine. There we go. Okay, enter optional one interface. This is if you had uh, three if you had a third network card and we don't, so we're gonna press enter. I'm sorry, I made a mistake. There we go. All right, so we see here, WAN is EM0, LAN is PCN0. Do you want to proceed? We'll press Y, and this will assign the network cards accordingly. Okay, and here we go, people. My WAN card automatically grabs an address from the DACP server. So in your case, this could be an address from your ISP's uh, router or modem. And my LAN is set to 192.168.1.1. This was set by PFSense in the previous, uh, previous lecture. So you need to go to this address to manage the firewall. So if you have your workstation plugged into the same switch and the network card is set to DACP, you should be able to go to this address and pull up the graphical user interface for PFSense. Alrighty, we'll see you at the next lecture.